Hello everyone, today I am going to share a recipe which is very close to my heart. It's a dosa made out of rice flour. You can also call it as rice flour crepe. And in my native land, Assam, we call it Assamese Pani Pitha. And I'm going to also make a mango lassi with, to go with it. So stay tuned and watch till the end. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please do subscribe, like and share. Let's begin. So I am taking half cup of rice flour. It's a ready-made rice flour. And add half teaspoon of salt to it. Give a quick mix. Now add water to make the batter. And this batter should be runny and not thick. I will add water and keep mixing it until I get the right consistency. So I think uh, the batter is ready. See the consistency should be runny. Uh, you can add some chopped onions and coriander. It's totally up to you. You can use the batter just like that to make plain dosas. I might need to add some more water after I added this uh, onion and coriander. But I will see while I make the dosas. Uh, so let's start to make the dosas. Add a few drops of oil on your pan and just brush it properly. So I'm going to add some batter to the pan with the ladle. This is very thick. This is not what I want. So I'm going to add some more water around half cup to my batter. After adding water, now I'm going to make a second one and just see the consistency ah yeah this is what i want because just see the net it is forming it should form a net when you pour it on the pan so this is the correct consistency of the batter let it cook for five minutes then drizzle some oil on the sides Once it is cooked properly, it will leave the sides on its own. So flip and turn to cook the other side. Drizzle some oil on the sides and let it cook until it is done. Just flip from the sides and just check if it is cooked properly. I will transfer it to a plate and then I will make some more crepes. So if your batter has gone thick again, add some more water. See how beautifully the net has formed in this one also. So the crepes are ready. Now let's go on to make the mango lassi. So it is just one ripe mango. Wash it properly and cut it into small cubes. Add 1 cup of full fat yogurt or Greek yogurt or any yogurt of your choice to your blender jar then add the mangoes and a few pistachios add 1 tablespoon of honey and half cup of water and now blend everything together this will make around 2 tall glasses of lassi so I am drizzling some honey on the sides it looks really fantastic so after that, I'm going to pour the lassi in the glass. You can make it ahead and refrigerate it to serve it chilled. And just garnish with some pistachios before you serve it. So a wholesome meal is ready to be served. It can be served as breakfast or snack. Thank you for watching. See you in my next video. And do not forget to like, share and subscribe.